Wild Hunt sailed aboard the Nagal Fair, a giant longship that traveled between worlds. As Gels had advised, the Witcher set out to find the Sunstone, an artifact needed to draw Aerodin into a trap. Must be the place. You can come out. I've seen your plan. Besides, I can hear you. One of you's wheezing like a broken bellows. Another's panting frantically like a deer caught in a trap. And the third should really take something for that throat. I'd try time extract. Someone care to explain what's going on here? What's going on is that you're down there, and we're up here! That's a situation I can fix quickly. Glitchy thingy no gum gum! The bounding witchy thingy swoop man! That's right! We've caught you! You're at our mercy now, and we're none too merciful! Oh really? Fact is, I could just turn around and... Bloody toad! Witchy thingy, gum gum, shucky, wolf, wolf man. I wonder why he's not already in that shrimp. You were to kill him. <sighs> what? We never said nothing about killing. Not a thing. We were just supposed to scare him. So witchy thingy us scary thingies. Make him no touch us. I believe you misunderstood. <sighs> He's a murderer. Like the rest of them. Like the one who killed my Adalia. <sighs> <clears throat> Awful sorry about your wench. We all are. A Doppler. But this Witcher didn't kill her. And we can't very well punish him for another's crime. He has much to answer for, too. <sighs> I heard he killed a Corrid in Tucson. But he spared a golden dragon. So what? What about Verena? The Bruxa with the fondness for blue roses from Nazaire. He showed her no mercy. <sighs> Arena killed many an innocent. I had to do something, but I've helped monsters aplenty. Yes? Who? I spared the troll named Whamawam, though I knew he'd killed some miners. Holy no! Make young a young elfie swoop. And uh, young a young sissy Don't make me laugh. That's not nearly enough. 
Some trolls live in a mountain pass near Kaer Morin. Know them? Poldy must. Looks like their brother. Last time I was there, they were begging for a beating. My friend wanted to kill them. I talked him out of it. You see? He's not that bad. We should let him go. Let him go? No! So he can track us down and butcher us? I won't hurt you. I don't kill sentient creatures. You lie. Every witcher is a murderer. <sighs> I kill monsters, true. It's my job. But only when they threaten humans. You hate us! Hate us all! Humans hate you all. Because they don't know you. Don't know which of you are dangerous and which want to live in peace. Only witchers stand between you and humans. We know both worlds. Protect both. We kill dangerous monsters so the thinking ones can live in peace. So you say now, as you stand there, scared. You know we have the upper hand. Ha, ha, ha. You don't. Could have killed you all long ago if I'd wanted to. I believe him. We should let him be. I'm all for it. To my thinking, he's telling the truth. Let witchy thingy go. Ah, fools! Gullible as newborns! A just witcher! A kind witcher! A lying witcher! He fiends it all! All humans lie! Let it rest! This is not the way! You shan't bring Adalia back! Ah, stay here! I'll finish this alone! Ah. Right? Monsters are like men. Some are good, some are bad, and still others simply lost. That's a right shame. I was different once. Should never have let him talk us into this. Here, a little something from us, so you'll remember not all monsters are dangerous. Thanks.
settings. Show me your whip. Somewhere. Siri says there's a site in Skellige we must examine. Avalok's clearly hiding something from us. Earlier, when we were in the Isles together, Avalok mentioned a laboratory. At one point, he wished to teleport there, to retrieve something. And he refused to take me with him. It was all very strange. Sufficiently suspicious, don't you think? So, what? Wanna just sneak in and root around? Exactly. Coming with? Fine. Where is it? On a small isle between Undvik and Spikerog. Not exactly on our way. Just found out the Sunstone's on Hard Skellig. A cavern along the coast that we can only access from the sea. Gonna need some real magic to get in, too. Go find this laboratory. I'll explore Ard Skellig. You can join me later. Philippa, your eyesight. Only just recovered and magically simulated. Didn't you say you'd need some time to get accustomed? Did I? I'd forgotten how irritating she can be. Come, Siri. We'll await you there. Yes, Geralt? Margarita any better? I managed to accelerate tissue regeneration. She's feeling much better. In fact, we must bring Eridin here as soon as possible. Otherwise, I'm afraid these sorceresses of yours will start fighting amongst themselves. You imprisoned Ciri the first time you met her. Now you protect her while fighting against your own kind. Quite an about face. First of all, I did not imprison her. She found me. It was her destiny. Yeah, sure. Get to the second of all. Why are you helping her? Because she is a danger. A mortal one. You look at her and see a human. A ward. A daughter, even. I look and see the Elder Blood. A power that can destroy the world. A power that must be kept from Eridin's power-addled hands at all costs. Admittedly, our motives differ. Yet in spite of that, we share a goal. So, you would be wise to trust me. Or at least try. From the look of things, pretty soon Siri won't need your help anymore. Nor yours. True. She'll do whatever she wants, and I'll support her. What about you? Ready to let her live her own life? I shan't force her to do anything, if that's your question. Tell me something more about Caranthir. Know him well? Know him? I reared him. Raised, don't you mean? No, Geralt. I began shaping him long before he was born. For centuries, I... Brought together pairs of elves manifesting certain abilities, those able to manipulate time and space. He is the result of these efforts. Caranthia, a golden child. A golden child who grew up to be a criminal. Charming world you and El have got. Could easily fall in love with the place. Tell me, how do you do it? Sit around playing flute? Painting rutting unicorns in gorgeous landscapes, building ornately sculpted towers. And then you murder us, without batting an eye, without a hint of guilt. How? Do you humans feel guilt when you murder Enshe elves? Or dwarves? Or dryads? We are the same. Simply because we both firmly believe others are inferior. 
so long. Yes, Geralt? You, uh, holding up all right? Uh, it'll be a hard slog for everyone. You know what I mean. What am I supposed to say? I mean, I knew you and Yennefer... ...that you'd end up back together. It was a lost cause. Always. I guess so. I just don't want you to... Can we not dwell on it? I need to focus on other things now. Right. Understood. So long, Triss. is very well protected. I believe we'll find some... So, any incriminating letters? Closets full of skeletons? We've not even opened the door yet. It's a highly complex magic barrier. Let's try. Yappa Ligon! Doesn't look much like a lab at all. That proves nothing. We must look around. It's a bit low, isn't it? Rummaging through his papers. You wish to come, my dear. Portrait of Siri, I think. No, that's not me. Where's the scar? It's definitely you. Hm. Really captured you. 
Sure, Avalok's only interested in you for your magic abilities. <laughs> Very funny. Look, Geralt! <laughs> Didn't know he had a sweet tooth. I've walked into somebody's bedroom. Yen. Genealogical chart of the Enhanikir, the Elder Blood, from Laura Doran. To me? You never showed me the full version. I had no idea Viedmont of Eden was an ancestor. Was he the one who punished his daughters with a hot iron? Or the one who had his own father's eyes gouged out? Him of the daughters. My, even I'd never seen the full version. Seems Avalark has analyzed all the paths of Lara's gene, even those we thought extinct. He's only analyzing? Really believe that? If he's anything like our mages, I seriously doubt he's standing back and observing how Lara's descendants are doing. I don't think we'll ever know if or how deeply the elves have meddled in the gene's mutation. Did you have a hand in... in what Geralt mentioned? The work of those human mages? Of course not. Let's look at his notes. Gods. He spent over two centuries on this. He was the first to study Lara's gene. Volker? Hmm. Some entries about Ciri. But it's here, later, that things get interesting. He actually tried to cultivate a genetic mix like Ceres, but one excluding the human line. Meaning what exactly? That I ought to be looking about for giant jars holding my siblings? Don't be foolish. Avalok never got that far. Apparently all his experiments ended in failure. You are unique. And that's why we've the Wild Hunt to contend with. Let's ferret on. See if we can't find something even more interesting. Standard. Might have expected a hidden portal. Hmm. Elves sure know their fragrances. Let's see what Avalux read. Someone's there. Beyond the door. Get in here. We mean you no harm. I care not at all why you're here. Get out. You. I remember you. From Tiernalia. Remarkable. I thought all elves looked alike to those of your race. If it's Avalach you seek, he's not here. I know. And yet you come here. What for? To spy on him. He tries his damnness to save you every time you do something stupid. Is that not enough? What can you possibly know about that? You'd be surprised. He's told me a great deal about you. Like what? He said you shed Lara's features. 
I don't see whatever it is he sees. It seems a bit like trying to drink water from a mud puddle. But I imagine that belief somehow helps him with his task. What task? Do you think he trails you everywhere for pleasure? Even I grow ill at the sight of you. It's incredible how those like you still believe you're superior to humans, in any way. She's no human. She's a degenerate half-breed. To have no choice but to use something like that, it's humiliating. Another word, and I'll... What? You'll change nothing. She must do what she must. Then Avalach will finally be free of her. If he hates me so deeply, why didn't he tell me to my face? Siri, you didn't actually believe her, did you? She's, uh, personally involved in the matter, that's clear. What of it? If they despise me so, they should leave me be! Siri... What? Do you fear I'll level this place like I did Care Morn? Shame I can't do that at will, because I'd really like to now. Get out of here. Let's see what Avalox really can. Must we return to the boat right away? Something else you want to see? Not here. On Hindisfjall. 
in Lofferton. I met a young man, Skjall. And I'd like... What is it? Siri. Skjall is dead. The Wild Hunt. Everyone? No one survived? Skjall died later. You sure it was him? You'd met him? I was there. I saw his body. Will you visit his grave with me? I'd like to... to say goodbye. I'll go with you. Thank you. Could you open a portal to Hindisfjall? I can. Let's do this. Come back soon, all right? Mm -hmm. See you. Look around. Should be a relatively fresh grave mound. Thank you for coming. I detest graveyards, especially wandering them alone. Let's look around together. Come on. Lasse, son of Njord. Olaf, son of Ova. Inga, daughter of Chortnir. He's not here. Skjall has no grave. Geralt, I shan't leave until I bury him. I think the body. What could have become of it? They didn't burn it. Save that honor for kings and heroes. Doubt they left him in the garden, too. Hmm. Uh, bastards. What? Beyond the village, there's a pit. They fill it with sheep taken by Blackleg. Crabs pick at their bones at night. What are you doing? What you should have done long ago. We're burying Skial. Burying Craven? You defy the right of the elders. Be gone. Leave this place. You defy our laws. Lower your voice before we need another grave. How can you defend him? Craven's place is in the ditch. Skjall saved your bloody lives. The Wild Hunt was after me. Had Skjall not led me away then, why they would have reduced Lofferton to ash? What would the Spectres be wanting of some lass who... I am not some lass. And anyone who so much as touches this grave will learn that the hard way. Hey, none will disturb it. Desecrating graves... Well... It's the only thing elders punish harder than fleeing the battlefield. And what you said... I can't know the truth of it. The gods will judge Skjall now. We were right to come. I was deeply troubled. I have no idea. Well, they shouldn't spit on his name anymore. Let's go.
back to the boat. Mm. 